I want to thank each and every one of you for coming out here tonight. The celebration of Becca and Anto's union as a married couple. I want to propose a toast. Everybody please raise their champagne glasses to a happy, healthy, fruitful life ahead. Cheers and gain not snoops. One thing I first realized about Anto and Becca was that they are total opposites. <laughs> and it's, it's very much a cliche uh, until you actually see these two in action. Uh, Anto is a force of nature, which is a euphemism for absolute natural disaster. Uh, and Becca is very meticulous. She kind of looks at things from a very close angle and makes sure everything is perfect and right. Last night, I was thinking about the time that I first ever met Becca, and I could not remember the first time I ever met Becca. She was always there. So, Anto, well done. Becca, good luck. And uh, welcome to the family. Cheers. Even though I'm only a minute older than Becca, I have always felt protective of her, and I always will. She has everything you could ask a sister to be. Though we don't get to see each other every day and confuse people, <laughs> we get to talk almost every day. People sometimes ask if we can read each other's minds, but we don't need to because there's rarely a day that goes by that we don't know how each other is feeling. <laughs> I could not be happier to be here today to see you marry the love of your life. Anto, I'm grateful to have another brother. In addition to what I have said about you supporting Becca, I'm grateful that you encouraged Becca to be spontaneous. I am so happy for you both and can't wait to see what you continue to achieve together. Cheers to this amazing couple and to me for getting through the speech. Woo!